Division II State Championship between Notre Dame Academy of Hingham and the Hopkinton Hillers. This should be a fun afternoon of high school volleyball. Both of these teams have just dominated Division II over the last few seasons. And one of these teams today is going to take home the state championship. 20 to 13 Hillers in set number one. In the back by Howley, the setup. Hit over, good dig there by Gilbert. And the oh. hit over for the Hillers point by Gogolin. And of course you have the uh, JV team that went undefeated as Miller serves that one up. And that's a Hillers point. Go by Coulter. Oh, great dig. Oh, by Gilbert. There it is. Hillers will take it. 25 to 17. They take set number one. And they dethrone last year's champion, Notre Dame Academy Cougars. Bumped by Miller. Gilbert. Oh, nice tap. Set up in front. Good blocks. Once again, it is Ivy Goblin. Gogolin has shut Dwyer down this whole set. 24-18, Hillers. Kelsey Dwyer on the serve into the net. Hillers takes set number two. 25 to 18, one set away from a state championship. Will the Hillers take home the state championship? for the second time in three seasons. Yes, they will! Hopkinton wins as Peyton Weber gets the winning point on the serve. 25 to 23 in set number three. And your Hopkinton Hillers are the Division II state champions. Unbelievable. What an ending. What a way to finish that off. Congratulations to the Hopkinton Hillers. They have claimed their second state championship in the past three seasons and have dethroned the 2015 state champion, Notre Dame Academy Cougars. How you doing? I'm good, I'm great. You won the state championship, how does it feel? It feels amazing. It was so much fun to play in this whole tournament, so it's awesome. It feels so great. Can you talk about the team this year and just this incredible run? What was it like playing with uh, your teammates? Oh my, I love my teammates. We had such a good season. We had so much fun together. And I think like the chemistry we had on and off the court just made it such a great team. And we had so much fun. It was awesome. Well, uh, can you talk about your performance today? You, you played against a team that also won a couple state championships yeah. in the past uh, four seasons. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> hold that up. Hold that up. State champions right here. How are you feeling right now? I'm um, really excited right now. <laughs> I don't, a lot of emotions. <laughs> well, you played against a, a great Notre Dame Academy team out there. Uh, what would you expect coming into this matchup? Did you think that you were going to get the sweep? Did you think it was going to go five sets? What were your thoughts coming into this tonight? I expected that it would be a really good game, and we hoped that it would be three a sweep, but we didn't. We were for, we didn't know for sure, and we definitely we were so excited. We played them two years ago and won, so we just really wanted to win again. So it was awesome, yeah. All right, what comes next? Celebration time? Yes, lots of celebration. Yep. <laughs> All right, well, you certainly deserve it. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you so much. How you doing? Um. Really good right now, I'm so excited. What was it like playing with this team all season in this run? What's it been like for you? Incredible, I'm so proud of these girls. We work so hard every day and I'm so proud of the way, how far we came. How much prep work went into preparing for this great uh, Notre Dame Academy team? Oh, so much effort, so many hours in the gym, Saturday practices, just working so hard. Were you nervous at all coming into uh, this afternoon, or did you have uh, confidence that your team was going to go out there and uh, bring home another title? I was so confident, and I was so confident in this team. We were just so awesome, I'm so happy. <laughs> uh, what, what comes next? Celebration time? Oh yeah, definitely. Big bus ride home. <laughs> I'm sure it's going to be a fun bus ride. Oh yeah, lots of screaming. <laughs> well, you certainly earned it. Congratulations. Thank you. I'm feeling pretty good. <laughs> Stay champs. <laughs> Stay champs. Absolutely. Stay champs. <laughs> What's it like to be able to say that you're state champions? Has it really hit you yet? No, it hasn't. It, it, like
like we couldn't believe that we actually made it this far and now I can't believe that we actually won so we're psyched right now. <laughs> What's it been like playing with this group all season long? Oh, it's been amazing. Yeah, it's, it's been such so a special group. Yeah, we're all such good friends and we love playing together, so, yeah. Any uh, big plans for the celebration? Hoping for a police <laughs> escort on the yeah. way home and then we'll probably, um, probably hang out, get some food. <laughs> I think there's, <laughs> absolutely, well you certainly deserve it. You must be uh, hungry after uh, playing so hard out there today. Yeah, yeah, yes, definitely. <laughs> All right, well, uh, go enjoy with your teammates, and congratulations, you're state champions. Thank you. How does it feel to be able to say you're a state champion? It feels great. I mean, we've worked so hard for this. We, I don't think we could be any happier right now. We are so excited. Now, you had a tremendous game out there, as did a few of your other teammates as well. Uh, what was it like uh, coming into this against this uh, Notre Dame Academy team that's won two state titles recently? Were you nervous at all, or did you feel like your team was ready to go? I think we were pretty excited. I know we've been doing well the past couple years, and so have they. I heard they've been in the state finals for the past three years, so coming in, we knew it was going to be a good game where we could really have a nice matchup, so we were all really excited. What's it been like playing with this group all season long? It's the best group of girls. I love everyone on the team. There's no drama, no nothing. We're just all like one big family, so it's been awesome. Well, I think it's going to be a good bus ride home for Definitely. you, to say the least. Very excited for the bus ride. <laughs> You're a state champion. Congratulations. Thank you. <laughs> How does it feel to be a state champion? It feels great. I'm so excited. What was it like playing with this group all season? It was awesome. All I have to do is just get to the center and they do the rest. So. <laughs> now, you played a team today that also uh, recently won a couple state championships. Were you nervous at all going into this matchup, or did you feel like your team was ready? I think we were prepared. Um, we've been preparing all season, and this is just another game, I feel. like. What comes now? Celebration time? Oh, yeah. We get the police escort. <laughs> well, congratulations. You certainly earned it. You're a state champion. Thank you. Awesome. Uh, second state championship in three seasons. How does it feel? Who would have thought it, right? Uh, it feels great. The, um, the girls came into the season with a preseason goal of being state champs. I mean, none of these girls were on that, that team. Four of them were pulled up during that team, but none of them were players on that team during the season. Um, but they had the goal. It's a winning tradition in Hopkinton, and, and they had the talent. Um, it was just such a small, it's a small, close-knit group. So, What's this group been like to coach? Such a joy. Such a joy. I mean, this is a smaller roster than I've carried in probably ever, and they were just so close-knit, tight, um, that it, it just translated well onto the court. Um, they helped each other out, picked each other up, always kept positive, and it was a pleasure going to practice every single day and showing up for games, and, and I don't know what I'm gonna do. Actually, tomorrow's banquet. I don't know what I'll do on Monday. What were the uh, practices like uh, coming into this matchup, getting ready for this Notre Dame Academy team that has also won a couple uh, state championships recently? Um, so, we really played it one game at a time. So, we were getting ready for Amherst and through Wednesday. So we knew we had two days to get ready for NDA. Thank you. And basically, we believed in ourselves and we know that we're a very well balanced team. And if we played our game, we've got offensive weapons all over the court. We've got defensive like, just weapons back there picking it up all the hits. Um, and they're a very strong team. We knew that coming in, but we, I think to be the best you got to beat the best and we were hoping to be able to see them um, at some point during the season so it worked out the way they were hoping actually so I know how are you feeling right now you're just full of joy or what you, you seem like you're about to explode with joy I'm so proud I am so proud like I just I every girl on this team I'm so happy for the seniors like uh, I'm happy for their accomplishments I'm happy they were able to reach their goals and to dig deep and you know accomplish what they set out to at the beginning of the season and and they're just creating their own legacy. I'm proud. I'm so happy for them. Well, Coach, another uh, great uh, performance by your team and another great coaching performance by you. Unbelievable job. Congratulations. Can I give a shout out? Absolutely. I think a big, big part of why we were so successful in the postseason was the fan support. Like, we had people in the stands that were just cheering, and, and it definitely, the girls were playing harder. They were, you know, they, they wanted to do it for each other for the coaches, for the school, and for their friends. So that was a big part of it. And the same, like the sub-varsity coaches and my assistant, Mary Bransfield, like it, we wouldn't be where we are without 
the support that we have, and there's so much um, talent in, in Hopkinton, and it's just being modeled by these sub varsity coaches. So it's easy for me when they come in and they're, you know, from day one ready to go and saying we want to win a state championship. You know, that that's the confidence and stuff comes from what they're getting at the sub the lower levels and the administration too. We got every you know everything we needed to make this a successful season. We were just supported a hundred percent. So, you know, it's 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 nice, but there's a lot of people that you know take a part and and own this championship. How about the television coverage that you get? Is it wonderful? Actually, <laughs> I was gonna say you guys are great, and I had so many people telling me that you know if they couldn't make a, a game that or a match that they were watching it on TV and. Um, it wasn't just the opposing coaches <laughs> that was telling me that. It was, you know, a lot of fans that they can't get out. They're able to watch it on TV, and that's important. And, and thank you so much. We're looking forward. Well, we enjoy uh, covering the team a lot, and it makes it all the uh, bit sweeter when there's a state championship uh, that you're taking home as well. It makes it even more fun to cover. It, you know what? It'll be a fun, loud bus ride, that's for sure. So thank you. Well, hopefully uh, there'll be many more state titles and many more fun, loud bus rides. But for now, enjoy this one. You certainly earned it. Congratulations. Enjoy right now. That's what we're going to do. So, and just reflect upon this amazing season. So, thank you. There is. Yeah! yeah. 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 yeah.